I am going to go home. I got to find a place to park this thing. But first, I got to fuel. Guys, it is so cold. Can you see my breath right now? It is absolutely freezing. I guess I never really explain how truckers go home. We can go home whenever we want, pretty much. Well, every company has like a different policy. I like, uh, for my company, I think it's, I think it's every 12 days. All I have to do is put the, um, the order in to, to go home on the tablet there and then the people working here and the the optimizer that picks the deliveries for me and the computer it'll just route me home i don't really go home that much because i mean i have everything here i go home like every two months i'm trying to go home like every two to three months now before i was going home like the last week of every month i would take like two or three days off at home This is a lot of traffic. I hate driving through big cities like this because this is what I have to deal with. And everyone's cutting each other off. I'm, I'm going like 50 miles an hour. <laughs> I want this space clear and I want space in front of me clear. Because then if I don't leave enough space here, like like say if I, I move in closer to close that gap, then people like this guy, they'll just start cutting me off. So I'd rather just Go slow as a turtle. Give them plenty of space to move over into here. I made it to the rest area. Do I want to buy an Uber or do I want to um, wait for my ride to get here after work? All right, it's so my ride. It's about to be here. I gotta pack everything I got. I got the video stuff. I got, I need shower stuff. Oh god, what is that? Oh my god. And then I can actually do laundry. I gotta take this, I gotta take everything. I am finally got home. Alright, I gotta put my stuff away, I gotta do laundry. So I haven't done laundry in a long time. And then, after that... Uh-oh. And... the battery's dead. Oh, this battery won't start either. How do you start this car? There's no key. Uh. Huh? Huh? Press brake to start. Okay. This is the place where it all happened. This is where I I had a, a big dream here. And I would like play just here, like four to six hours a day. Because the uh the uh tennis coaches are expensive. We couldn't like afford that much. And so like I would just play over here for a couple of hours. From uh, like the age of like uh, 15 to uh, maybe 20. Like this this was it right here. I remember a couple of years ago. This, that was the spot where I almost gave up. I came really close to. But uh, I never did. And I'm so glad that I did. 
that I didn't because it's given me everything that I have today. You really can have absolutely anything you want in your life. The secret is you have to give more than anyone else around you. Anyone else in the world, that's who you're competing against. If you do that, if you're willing to go through all the failure, I went through so much failure. I came home in tears multiple times because I just failed. I wasn't where I was gonna be. I was placed last on my tennis team even though I was working. <laughs> I was working here four, four to six hours every day. Well, six days a week. And I was placed last on my tennis team. But I never gave up. And eventually I was able to get uh, a college scholarship for tennis. Alright, so I just finished with tennis. Now I gotta go drop off my laundry that I did while I'm home. I gotta go drop it off at the truck and my groceries. Oh gosh. I'm just gonna throw this for another day. I got, oh dude, dude, these are so good. Granola bars, RX bars, they're amazing. And, and they're actually healthy. I mean, granola bars are like my breakfast every day. So I kind of had to buy something healthier than, than the granola bars I was getting. Red stuff. Tomato sauce. <laughs> it tastes like pizza. <laughs> pizza bread. It tastes exactly like pizza. Chicken Francesi. We're good. Chicken Francesi. Thank you. Mine's still delicious. Yeah, but I added chicken. I, I like chicken. I like chicken. You could. He got shrimp. Oh, my. I got shrimp. Okay. Let's see. Bueno, come bien. Thank you. Where is it? In a filet mignon? It has been a very, very long time since I've had spaghetti. And this was worth the wait. No, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but it's really like, it's very light. Thank you. Enjoy. I don't know what tiramisu is. Thank you. We each get a corner. I don't know what this is. Tiramisu. like ice cream but with fluffy bread <laughs> <laughs> I'm expanding I'm going through the border over there that's I'm your dad's through. side that's your <laughs> side look at mine look at your dad he's invading <laughs>